Well, let's get started. Today, we're playing Speedrunner vs. Hunter with a twist. The rules are simple. All I need to do is slay the Ender Dragon without dying. If I fail, Mikey wins. Wait, let's get this straight. If you hit zero hearts even once, I win? That's right. Or if I can't slay the Ender Dragon myself. There's another twist to this game to make it even more interesting. I've prepared two chests for us over here. We each get to choose one and can only use what's inside. Cool, right? Ooh, I wonder what's inside. Well, this is what's inside the left chest. There's a bow and some arrows, dragon's breath, and some ranged items. That kind of thing. I see. Not bad. Not bad at all. Let's see. The right chest contains a full set of diamond equipment, golden apples, and some scaffolding. Your pick, Mikey. A trident and some arrows? Or diamonds and golden apples? Really? Yeah. It's obvious. Huh? Duh. I choose this one. Oh, so you chose the diamond equipment, golden apples, and scaffolding? Yep, you got it. Okay, then that means this one is mine. Let's take a closer look. I get a bow, dragon's breath, a cobweb, some fire charges, a trident, and a crossbow. Hmm. Plus a wooden sword, wooden axe, and some arrows. Are you really okay with this? Sure. I mean, yeah, you got all the flashy stuff, but I have a good feeling about this. It's all useful. Uh, do you mind if I craft with it? Huh? Can you really craft something from all that random stuff? Though I do have a full set of diamond equipment. Go for it. It looks good on you, Mikey. Okay, crafting time. I think the trident goes here, then the fire charges on the sides, and then the dragon's breath, the crossbow, and then the box here. Maybe the cobwebs go down here? Hmm? Sword and axe. Huh? Whoa, it worked! Really? Three, two, one. What? Yeah, sick. What is that? Look. What did you make? Whoa. It looks powerful, but also kind of broken. I bet my diamond armor is tougher. I'm ready. Let's go. OK, in that case, let's play. I need to slay the ender dragon without dying. Ready, set, go. Oh, yeah! I need to run fast. I'm going to get you. Ah! Here I am. Oh! <laughs> huh? What? Not bad. What happened? Huh? Got to go. Bye. An instant kill? Awesome. Well, Mikey, this is actually the ultimate bow. That's crazy. Just take aim and... Pew! Whoa. Okay, let's play. I feel a little bad. It's kind of overpowered. I'm not giving up. Things just got interesting. Good luck catching me, Mikey. For now, I need to scavenge for food. Oh, wow, that was easy. I'm coming. I'm getting food. Wow, look at all the meat lying around. The explosions are so powerful that there's a lot of collateral damage. Hunting took no time at all. This is totally awesome. There's more here. I'm all loaded up. Great. Yay, I discovered a village. Look, pigs. I should stock up on more food, something other than meat. I'll grab this wheat stacked over here. Those hay bales had a whole lot of wheat in them. With this much, I'll have plenty of food. Now I'll turn it into bread. This'll only take a minute. I'll build the crafting table, then unpack the wheat, then I can use it immediately. All right, I have 21 loaves. Things are coming along. All right, next up, I'll chop down some trees for wood. Huh? Hang on a second. Hmm? I think it just... Look at this. Did my weapon evolve? The parts that were wood are diamond now. No way. I'm going to try firing it. Here goes nothing. Whoa. No way. Hold on. Is this for real? It's so much more powerful. Could this crazy bow evolve even more? Man, it's totally overpowered. Well, it's good for me, so I guess I shouldn't complain. Great! I'm back in the village to get some more exploring done. The bow's evolution has me in a good mood. Hmm? Hang on, what's that? Huh? This can't be right. These are enchanted. Why are there golden apples lying around? Wow, there's practically a whole bushel of them. These are the best items in the game. Whoa! This feels weird to me. I think they're leading to a house. Something's rotten about these golden apples. Is there something suspicious in that house? 
Did Mikey do this? Maybe. Well, it may seem suspicious, but as long as I have this crazy bow, everything should be fine. Even if it is a trap. All right, I'm going in. Let's see what's inside. Hmm? Huh? Wait, what's happening? Hold on, I've been locked in. Seriously? I can't believe I fell for Mikey's trap. Ugh, this is crazy. There has to be a way out, right? Huh? Oh, it's JJ! Ugh, Mikey! Oh my! Huh? You really fell for it! I built this trap just for you! Sorry, but I win! What? Mikey, let's talk this out! Why? Are you about to pour lava in here? How perceptive of you! No! Here it comes! What? Slow down! Yes! Blow free, my lava! What now? Huh? Oh, right. I still have this. I'll aim for the ground and fire! What? No! Whoa! How? What just happened to my trap? This is insane! Wow! Huh? Yeah, I'm not sure how, but my bow evolved. <gasps> it leveled up. The whole house is destroyed, and the recoil blasted me out of the trap. That's too much! Man, if I didn't have this bow, I would have been a goner. That was a pretty nasty plan. Wow! Now that Mikey's out of the way, I should find a cave. I want to find ores and... Oh, I should try to get golden diamonds. You know, going out of my way to find a cave is a hassle. I have an idea. I'll stand on this stack. Why should I hunt for a cave when I can just make my own? Aim down and... Whoa! Uh-oh! Again! Wow, not bad. It's kind of out of control, though. I'm gonna try harder. Higher this time. Okay, fire! I'm gonna aim around there. Yeah, just like that. I'll carve out a cave, then go down and collect all the diamonds and gold I can carry. Man, this is great! I never thought I'd be able to make my own cave. All right, it's turning into a massive cavern down there. Almost a ravine. Once all the fires go out, I'll go down and gather all the loot that's dropped. I wonder how much it'll be. Probably a ton. <laughs> I can't wait! All right. Now the fires are out, I want to go down there and check out my loot. Nice, right into the water. Then what? Oh, that's not safe. There's a ton of lava. I need to be careful. Just keep building. A little more. And jump! Whoa! Huh? No way, this is incredible! Oh, check out all these diamonds! Look at the gold, too! Wow, this is unbelievable! Jeepers creepers, there's a lot of enemies down here. I'm too focused on collecting all the good stuff to focus on them. There's just piles of it everywhere! Oh, what's that? There's a bunch of coal ores lying all over the place. That's awesome! I'll make torches so I can see what I'm doing better. Oh, there was a lot more hiding in the dark. If I collect all of this, I'll be filthy, stinking rich! I'll have my very own treasure trove of goodies. My bow was the reason all of this was possible. All right, I think I've gotten almost all of it. Not bad. I've gathered more than enough. Oops, missed some. I'd hate for it to go to waste. Let's see. 66 diamonds and a ton of gold ore. Over 100 blocks of it. That's insane. I'm going to smelt all of the gold. Then I want out of this creepy dark cavern. It's going to take a while to smelt all of this. I'll place a few furnaces on the wall here. Oh, hey, zombie. Yep. All right. Cool. So now, I'll load them up with coal, toss in the oars, and get this show on the road. Once I have enough gold, the ender dragon should be a piece of cake. I'll explain my plan a little later. It's a good one. For now, I'm just going to sit back and relax by the furnace until the gold's done cooking. All right, all my gold is finally done smelting. That took a while. Everything's going according to plan. I'll explain it all later. I also cooked all the meat, since the furnaces were going anyway. Not a bad haul in this cave. 
I got 118 gold ingots and a bunch of diamonds. This is awesome, even better than expected. I think I'm ready to go to the nether. Yeah. Hmm? Hold on a sec. Am I seeing this right? Really? I was just about to go find a lava pool to start prepping the nether portal, but there's already a functioning portal right here? Wow, am I just that lucky? I must be. I don't even have buckets or obsidian yet. I could just walk in, not preparing a thing, right into the nether. I don't know why this portal is out here in pristine condition, already lit and ready, but I'm just happy I found it. Today just keeps getting better and better. The bow, the cave, and now this portal, just out in the open. All right, into the nether I go. What? Huh? <gasps> really? Huh? No! You fell for the pit trap, JJ! You're not getting out of this one! Prepare to meet your doom! Hmm, how should I do it? Hold on, you did this? Yep. Again? You're so gullible, <laughs> JJ. It's easy. Hmm, well this was a good trick. But watch this, I can still escape! Oh, really? Like this! Wait! Go! No! <laughs> Sorry to foil your plan, but when I use this bow, oh! the force of the explosion launches me into the air! Woohoo! It's so strong! Cool, right? Okay, well, I may have literally fallen for another of Mikey's clever traps, but I escaped with my pride and a full health bar. I'll get you next time! All right, I wonder if I can relight it with my bow. Oh, perfect! The gate reactivated with just one shot. I get to use the portal after all. Man, this thing is destructive. Look at the wreckage. I'll use some scaffolding to climb back up. Okay, no more dilly-dallying. To the nether I go. Even if it was a trap, Mikey did make a portal just for me. It's kind of sweet. Oh, I'm barely out of the portal and a ghast is already trying to attack me. It doesn't stand a chance. Whoa! Wow, there's something you don't see every day. One-shotting a ghast? Oops, that's not good. I need to make a golden helmet so the piglins won't attack me. They'll leave me alone if I wear gold. Silly piglins. All right, I'll take care of the skeleton. Now I want to do something interesting. All right, I've lured the piglins into this pit. If you give them gold, they trade a random item back. Sometimes you get good stuff. Whoa, not too bad. Oh, I even got seven ender pearls from them. We need more. To get to the end, I need at least 12 pearls. Keep them coming, boys. Wow, these trades are going great. Whoa, who did that? Oh, that pesky ghast. Okay, it's down. Oh no, a piglin escaped. Woohoo! Eleven ender pearls. Just a few more. This is the last of my gold. Yes! Now I have 16! That's awesome! That's more than enough. Which means it's time to move on. The next thing to do is find a nether fortress and slay the blazes. Oh, I found one! If I hunt the blazes inside, they'll drop blaze rods, which are really important. Fortresses are convoluted, so I'm gonna smash through with my bow. I was just gonna blow up parts of the fortress, but I destroyed too much. I'll start hunting. Oh, a blaze! I'm gonna use my bow as a melee weapon. Nice! Any rods, buddy? No. Oh, more blazes! Sick! Well, I got one! A blaze rod! This is what I've been looking for. All right, I've collected plenty of rods. Eight of them to be exact. That should be enough for what I'm planning. I guess that's all I needed to do in the nether, so it's time to go back home to the overworld. Then I'm off to slay the ender dragon. First, I'll have to find the stronghold, of course. I think I'm pretty equipped to end that dragon, so I'm feeling really confident. Wait, I'm pretty sure I came this way before, but where's the portal? What? No, the portal's been destroyed! How? <laughs> Is that Mikey? Ah, too bad, JJ! 
I destroyed the portal, so now you're trapped here. Seriously? How could you do something so ruthless? You don't have any obsidian, do you? Wait, how do you know that? You've been keeping track, huh, Mikey? I know everything! I didn't bring any with me. I can't defeat you when you have that bow, but I can trap you inside the nether for eternity! What do you think of my brilliant scheme? But did you plan to trap yourself as well? Oh, watch out! <gasps> Whoa, that was close! That's a good plan, but... What? I didn't bring any obsidian, but I have some now. No! Eleven blocks! How? These piglins traded it to me. No! You're lying! I can fix it! This plan was foolproof! Don't do it! No, I messed up! Huh? Shoot! I dropped my fire starter! I can still light it, though! Whoa! Ah. No! It wasn't supposed to happen like this! Come on, light already! If it weren't for that bow! Just work already! JJ! Please! I win! Oh, it's I lit! I can't believe this! Okay, I need to go through before Mikey breaks it again! You can't do this, JJ! I have to get back to the overworld! No! This is crazy! Please! Sorry, Mikey! Don't leave me behind! Here I go! But we're friends! You're right, but I'm sorry! I'm going! I'll leave it lit for you, Mikey! JJ, no! Whoa, that was a lot. Right now, I'm standing directly above the stronghold. Also, I can't believe it, but my weapon evolved again! Look! What used to be diamond is now netherite! Is it because I was in the nether? Now I want to take it for a test run. If the stronghold is right above me, then I'm going to try blasting my way down into it. Let's see what happens. Ready? Three, two, one. Fire! Whoa! Huh? What just happened? This thing is crazy. I don't see it yet, so I'm going to shoot again. Wow! Man, this is kind of overkill. Hmm? Whoa, hang on. Well, I'm going for a ride. I'm pretty sure I saw the stronghold somewhere down here. Oh, there it is. The portal room. Wow, I found it already. Now I just have to very carefully get over there to the end portal. Almost there. Ouch, hot! Oh, there are already two spots filled. Nice! I guess I was shooting this bow directly at the portal without realizing it. Lucky me! I'll place the eyes in all the empty slots now. Once I fill this in, I'll be able to enter the end. Last one! The Ender Dragon in there is the final boss. Mikey might have given up, so I just have to focus on slaying the Ender Dragon. Then I win! I made it to the end. Victory will be mine! Where's the dragon? Uh, but before I start fighting, I should be smart and destroy all of the end crystals first. I'll climb up the tallest tower I can find so I can take aim on all of the crystals. If I don't destroy these, the dragon can use them to heal at any point during the battle. I don't want to give it any advantage like that, so let's do this. All right, I made it to the top. From here, I can see all of my targets on the other towers. I'll use my bow to blast them all, like this. Whoa! That shot made quick work of that crystal. This bow is insane! That was awesome. I think there's only two left. I'll take aim and break them. I think I destroyed them all, but let's see. Nice! Yes, I did it! Oh, wait, there's one more. It's the last one. Yeah. Sick! They're gone! Whoa, ouch! Well, now that every end crystal is destroyed, I feel ready to take on the Ender Dragon. Let's go! What? Huh? Mikey? Yes! What are you doing? <gasps> My final plan! I know what to do! I'll win! Hmm? If I land the finishing blow on the dragon, then you won't be the one who slayed it! You'll lose! <gasps> That's right! The rules we set in the beginning! Exactly! That's a pretty tricky plan, Mikey. Thank you. There's no time to waste. It's here. Nice. Here goes nothing. I'm gonna slay it before you. I've come this far. I'll win. Whoa. Come on. It's mine. No way. It's mine. Huh? <laughs> no. Hang on. What? Yeah. No. 
Oh, that must have been me, right? Huh? Right? It's going down. Yeah. I don't know. Is it over? Um. Uh. Look, it's down. Whoa. Wow. I did it. You're too strong. I think it was me. I did it. You did it. Yeah. Woohoo. That was amazing. I fell in. Looks like Mikey got sucked into the portal. Well, today, I crafted the ultimate bow and used it to take down the Ender Dragon before Mikey. Good job! If you enjoyed today's adventure, please be sure to like and subscribe. Bye-bye!